Hello everyone, my name is Torun. Once again, welcome to PE Worlds. Once again, I came with another video and this video is once again for ISC class 12 physical education. In my previous few videos, I have discussed about the answers of the questions uh, from the specimen paper which has been given for your semester 2 examination. If you have missed to watch those videos, you can uh, go to the link what has been given, for, uh, the playlist link what has been given for you uh, in the description box. Uh, so that you can watch those videos and get benefited and anyway here in this video i am going to talk about the answers of the questions from volleyball what has been given for your semester two examination let me remind you one uh, information that i am preparing the question and answer set for your uh, semester two examination so uh, i'll be coming with those videos also so stay tuned and if you are new to our channel please subscribe it for more information about physical education and sports anyway without further ado Let's start the video. ISC semester 2 examination, uh, specimen question paper, physical education theory. So I have discussed uh, section A. Uh, I have discussed the answers of section A, section B, and uh, the answers of the questions from a uh, few of the games from section C. Likewise, the football I have discussed, cricket I have discussed. Basketball I have discussed, badminton I have discussed and also I have discussed about the answers of the questions from athletics and today I, as I mentioned that I will be discussing the answers of the questions from volleyball. Anyway, uh, let's start with the answers. Okay, questions from volleyball. The first question, least any four attack errors with reference to the game of volleyball so attack errors means basically uh, this is indicating the, the spiking whenever the players are going to spike or the smash the volleyball so what kind of errors they face so the first one is hitting out of bounds so uh, this is all one uh, error what the attackers face next one is hitting into the net I mean the well the spiker is going to hit, uh, smash the ball and the ball is directly touching the net and the ball is not going to the opponent's court it is just falling inside their court only so then it will be an error blocking blocking is also a uh, error when the spiker is trying to smash and, and the blocker of the opponent team is blocking and the ball is getting deflected and going out of the court then it, it is also a, an error next one is net or center line violation Next, uh, net or central line violation means whenever the spiker is going to hit the ball or smash the ball, at that point, while he is landing on the ground, he's, if he crosses the central line or he touches the net, then it is also an error. So, there are a uh, few more errors are there. If you look into the book, then you can get it. Next question. Answer the following questions. The first one is, when the technical timeout applied in a game very important question when the leading team reaches eight points and 16 points in first second third and fourth set as you know that in a football, volleyball game uh, there will be five sets so out of five sets in first four sets you will be getting the technical timeouts and that also in eight points as well as 16 point any uh, team which leading uh, and reaching to 8 points and 16 point they will be getting the uh, after that the time technical time timeout will be given okay now next question is state the duration and number of technical timeout given the duration is 60 second for each timeout and the two technical timeout as i mentioned before also and uh, in first set second set third set and fourth set no uh, timeout in fifth set when the leading team is reaching 8 set, 8 and 16 point. Fine. Next question. After the serve, the ball just touches the net and lands on the side sideline of the opponent's court instead of falling inside the play area. What will be the referee's decision in or out? And which team will be given a point? Definitely the serving team will be getting the point. Because uh, when the ball is falling on the line, the side line, and uh, instead of the court, even though it is not falling in the inside the court, 
uh, it is also an inball because uh, the lines are included in the port and the uh, point will be going to the serving team that means the, ser the server team will be getting the point next question while lifting the serve the lifter uh, misjudges the ball's flight and the ball hits his face instead of touching the hand what will be the referee's decision so it will be it is allowed the rally will continue because uh, the ball is coming directly and hitting the uh, face and if the ball is going up and the other player is uh, throwing the ball or just pushing the ball to the opponent's court then the rally will continue and if the ball falls down on the ground then the uh, the opponent team will be getting a point. This is the decision. So this is all about the answers of the questions from volleyball. So thank you so much for watching this entire video. Uh, please subscribe our channel and share with your friends uh, so that they also get benefited. And do not forget to like and comment. Thank you so much.